Okay, well, welcome back. Today, the benefits of cardio exercise. Wow, you look good today, Molly. <laughs> Huge snakes. I'm afraid of snakes. Snakes. How about for hosting the Emmys? Are you afraid snakes will crawl oh. on the stage? No. Have you heard that they're coming on the stage? The last time I talked to you outside of Twitter was actually when you hosted Miss America My Year. So it's nice to see I you again. I remember that. Two, I remember that. 2004. You and I were in Atlantic City. Uh, your talent. You were singing, I believe. I was. Oh, okay. And you're gonna wink at me, right? I met you in 2005, and I told you at that time that I used to wear. Hulk pajamas in the 80s when I was a little kid. And when I saw you, it was at a Starkey Hearing Foundation where you also spoke about your hearing loss. There's me in my Hulk jammies. Oh my God. <laughs> and you said to me, do you remember? Yeah. What did you say? You're still wearing the pajamas? Yeah. Hi, everybody. I'm Lara It's been really nice to be on the morning blend. We'll see you at the stage fair today. Oh, what? <laughs> We've decided he's a big deal here, too. John's an author, an actor, a singer, and today we're thrilled to have him sing for you. So take it away, John. I need you, baby, to warm a lonely night. I love you, baby. Trust in me when I say, oh, pretty baby. Don't what's, your, what's your favorite uh, <laughs> song to sing? What do you oh. sing in the shower, John? I, well, I don't really sing in the shower. I just kind of shout in the shower. But um, <laughs> give me the shampoo. Uh, I mean, I've recorded about nine albums in the UK. Look at my kiss. Your mom oh, called me. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! I think we our executive producer <laughs> gone. Oh my gosh! The show no, is she's not. Too. She's standing there taking she's pictures that she's going to yes. sell to the National Enquirer after it. She's like, why am I over here? Can we at least plug our book? Yes. yes. Okay. Who's <laughs> here? Okay, there, Hollow Earth. We're going to actually give one away because this is a fiction And it's a book signed copy. Yeah, I will come back. I've had a really <laughs> great time. Oh, thank you. you. Did have I a did. Good time? I've had a great time. Oh, this is a lot you. of fun. I'll come back too. Look at Thanks, Carol. I feel like I'm chatting to my three sisters. Yay. Sister. <laughs> you know, it was one of those things. I mean, it's the worst feeling ever when you get pulled over. It's like that moment that you realize, like, those lights are for you. Yes. Because I was driving. I wasn't even paying attention. I was just sort of like singing to the music, you know, driving through the park. It's a great day. And all of a sudden, I I see the lights and I'm like, are those, are those for me? me? No way! Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I did uh. that totally in my mirror, like, me? What? Huh? And then pulled over and they were. And he's like, did you see me behind you? Oh, it was so. very nice of him to um, let you go with a warning. And it was. Thank you, officer friendly. Yeah. And that, that park is tough because, you know, you kind of go a little quickly through there. Yeah, and so the speed limit. Slow down. We're going to talk about the new Denzel Washington film, which is yes. Flight. Mm -hmm. And you actually had your movie club review this together with you, which was fun. And I got to go with you. It was. I was so excited. We had about 40 Morning Blend viewers join us. That plane crash. Denzel Washington successfully crashed crash lands a plane mm -hmm. and then thereafter it turns out he was drunk while doing so. I loved it and we actually talked, I talked with a couple of the viewers afterward too, we're talking about the fact if you've ever experienced uh, alcoholism in your family, mm -hmm. which a lot of us have, there, there's really poignant moments in this. In fact, I, you know, I actually cried at the end. Did you? Yeah. Did it get you at it all? It absolutely connected to me emotionally. It's an incredible performance. Yeah. What about Wreck-It Ralph? That's another one that's opening today. Yes, this is the new Disney animated feature. It's in 3D. How about the 3D? Because I'm a little Debbie Downer on 3D sometimes. <laughs> it's not must-see 3D, so if you can have the 2D option, I'd see it that way. But it's still it's still decent. Okay, and you've got another movie club pick coming up for Skyfall. Yes, yes, another one. It's coming up for next week. Lots of remakes. It's yep. going to be fun. Thanks, Ryan. Well, you can like Ryan J on Facebook, follow him on Twitter, and for his full movie reviews, check out his website, ryanjreviews.com, and join his movie club. So much fun. Good morning! Facebook fans in the audience. Everybody wave Hi, with our Facebook, Facebook fans. fans. We've got some family, some friends, a lot of people who helped make today happen. So we're so excited that you're all here. And we want to know, those of you at home and those of you here by a raise of your hands, how many of you are done with your holiday shopping? Completely done with Anyone? holiday shopping. There's one. There's one. Two. Okay. You guys are going to okay. get beat up after the show because yeah. everybody's mad at you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>
<laughs> but the reason why we ask is because Molly's got these great holiday lessons, and one of them has to do with your holiday one shopping. One of them has to do with shopping. Sure. Yeah, okay, for sure. Okay, switching gears a little yeah. bit, I found these great phrases that he hates. Yeah, these are phrases that guys hate. So yeah. all the guys in the audience, Get ready Mark to Brand, I want you to be nodding if you've heard this. The number one phrase that guys hate, I'm so fat. <laughs> I feel right? so fat. Yeah, guys, don't you don't you hate hearing that?